Before I discuss the two corollary tips to the first and most important musicianship tip of this video series, I'd like to recap it. Now, based on your inclination, choose a few areas of musicianship skill sets and then try to address at least two, if not more of them, simultaneously. Now remember the keyword is addressing simultaneously rather than trying to perfect one skill set at a time and only then moving to the next. Now this brings me to the first corollary tip, which is while trying to address one skill set, if the lacunae of another skill set either becomes a roadblock or becomes too apparent, do not shy away from trying to address it or at least investigate it a bit. Now this comes out of human nature, which I like to call inertia or resistance to trying out a new idea when one is already caught swimming deep inside another idea. Bottom line is, first, be open to that realization that some skill set or rather the lack of it is either becoming a roadblock or just popping up too many times for us to ignore. Second, be open to challenging yourself because remember, in doing so, there's that distinct possibility that it can lead to an exponential growth in your development. Recall from the analogy in the previous part where it compared developing musicianship skills to a treasure hunt inside this infinitely tall building called music with certain rules to this treasure hunt. Now corollary tip number two comes from there and it goes thus. The rules of the treasure hunt remain the same even as you climb up the floors of this imaginary building. Which means to say that whether you are on a lower or a higher floor, you still need to employ the same approach of attacking multiple skill sets at the same time if you desire a not only fulfilling but also a continuous and unabated learning and growth curve. Now, practically, what this means is that whether you are a beginner, intermediate or advanced musician, the game still remains the same. The rules of the game still remain the same and hence how you play it at every level must also remain the same. Now in all probability it could so happen that as you move from being a beginner to an intermediate to an advanced musician you still keep encountering the same skill sets over and over again just that you get deeper inside each skill set. Probably what you do not realize is that by attacking multiple skill sets at the same time you are upping the chances of understanding the deeper underlying relationships and interconnections between each of these skill sets and thereby also upping the chances of understanding the crux of this game that much better. 